Oh, this is not. Hey, okay, new location, same video. And of course, you know, it's a, a little bit, you know, too low. Okay, let's try this, let's try this again. Hi, hello, you can see the blinds on my shirt. Maybe it looks like a really cool pattern. A lot of people seem to think that I have it all together and I know what I'm doing with my life and that I'm the perfect display of mental health and I just wanted to let you know that I'm not, like at all, I don't know what I'm doing. And I've realized I don't know what I'm doing. Um, besides the fact that I don't know what I'm doing is when people ask that one question like, what do you do? Like, hey, how are you? I'm Nathaniel, what, what do you do? And I'm just like, typically have no idea how to answer that question and it makes me really frustrated y'all probably know what y'all want to do right y'all y'all have some passion some cool thing that you like like you're an artist or a dancer or you're really good at engineering or plants you're a planter it's pretty sure it's not it's farmer but i don't think i have one of those things there's a dog in front of me that is distracting she ran away I don't think I have one of those things and it's really frustrating. Yeah, sometimes I draw and you know, sometimes I make YouTube videos. <laughs> Subscribe. But I really don't have like a thing I'm passionate about and it makes me really sad when people ask, what do you do? And I just have no idea how to answer that question. I answer honestly, I always say, I have no idea. I'm not really sure. And they're like, well, what do you like to do? And I'm, well, they not, we never get that far. They kind of walk away at that point. I just kind of wish I knew, you know, because it seems once you answer that question, I guess people see you as valuable or feel like, you know, you have some purpose in your life. And if you don't, they just look at you like, oh, they don't do anything, which is completely bad and wrong and you shouldn't do that. But I feel kind of, you know, a little bit not valuable or like, I feel like I'm missing like a core part of being a person. It's like having something and by no means you probably don't need to have that it's just, i guess i've just been trained that that that's what you do you go to school you pick a major or you go out of school and you go into a job and this is essentially like half of your life and like you have a purpose and you're helping do whatever it is or create whatever that is and that kind of i guess creates some sort of happiness and fulfillment i'm not sure if that's been trained by me by society that that's what i like think that i need it so I'm kind of putting it on myself that I need it and making this like imaginary problem or that it really is like that and someone was onto something and you probably do need the thing. I mean there's other ways to get happiness and fulfillment and stuff like that like through other people, through helping out. Even then you have a passion about something. I'm just really struggling and I guess I want to say that don't fret if you're like me and if you aren't like me, congratulations. Good job. But if you are like me, I guess I'm just gonna try to dabble in a lot of things. And I guess this YouTube video is one of them. But I guess I'm gonna just dabble in a lot of things instead of, you know, binge watching American Horror Story and like anime. I suggest you do the same. If you're like me, please leave in the comments below things you might wanna dabble in to figure out your passion or what do you do? What do you label yourself as? Which I feel like you shouldn't like have to have this label, but I guess it helps. Um, some people, especially probably me, like figuring out their identity. Even in, oh my god, even in Instagram or Twitter, you have that bio. I don't know what to put there. If you read mine, it says human person thing. I'm not even sure what I am. Obviously, I'm just struggling. This is just me rambling. I just gotta show you this dog. She doesn't really like me. She keeps running away every time. Maybe she'll walk in? Maybe not. Oh. Yes! That had no point. It had a point, it's just thoughts coming out. I don't know, I think I'm gonna start using YouTube as like a visual, verbal diary of some sorts because you can't always talk to people in the vent. Maybe I'll get better at venting to this camera and pretend like it's a person and like I have some friends. Um, that got a lot darker than I thought it was gonna get. But I hope you like this video. Um, hello new subscribers, I'm Kiera. Um, if you don't know me, here's a quick spiel about who I am I I don't know the end I guess you're gonna be here for that journey and if you leave you're not gonna be follow me on Instagram and snapchat and Twitter 
Um, that'd be cool. I would really like that. You're like my friends. And <gasps> did you do you see her? Lola. Watch this. I'm gonna go to her and she's gonna run away. <laughs>